Let's see, that's what's going on in the world of gaming today. Are you freaking serious right now? Oh my gosh. Oh no. Can you guess what this video is about yet? Come on now. Come on. It's about Shovel Knight. A game I've never played. Um, until today. We're gonna... I've already bought it. I've downloaded it. Played it a little bit. So I'm gonna record my reactions to this, uh, super hyped side-scroller. You know, since we don't get enough side-scrollers anyways. So, obviously Shovel Knight's getting an amiibo. But I, all I hear all the time is like, it's so good. I'm like, why? And I just keep it back. It's so good. I'm gonna play it again for you guys. We're gonna find out what's so freaking good about Shovel Knight. By the way, last night it was when I played it. This last night, I played me about five minutes of it, so I don't really have my full, you know, reaction, like my full opinion adjusted about it. But I figured out a couple things I already don't like about it. So let's go ahead and jump into this, right? Ooh, Shovel Knight. That music, though. That's, we're gonna obviously do a new adventure here. Let's just pick up, let's make it. Turd. Skip. What's up with the freaking? Look at that, it's like not even working right now. What the frick? There we go. I don't know what happened there. Alright, alright. So, for starters, obviously, this is a big, uh, like, it's supposed to be like a shout out to all the old classic games, which that's fine and all, but. That doesn't make the game good. Not at all. So don't, don't use that argument against me. Alright, I'm assuming we can jump on this enemy, right? Like, you know, jump jumping on it like any other platformer, right? And not get hurt? I'm done. I'm done. I get it, okay? It's like an homage to all the old, like, NES games, all those old great platformers. But I can't even jump on an enemy to kill it. Don't, before you get started, I realize I have to hit shovel down in order to hit it. But that's, that takes away from, like, the fluidity of it. And, I don't know. And I'm not going to just judge it based off of that. That is a crappy thing about it. But I am still going to go ahead and play it and finish it. But that right there was enough to actually set me off to not want to play it for a little while. Like... I can't jump on it. I'm just, I know that sounds a bit picky, but like, let me just go ahead and just say this here. Art style and music does not make a game good. And three, three, it's a freaking side-scroller. If you look like on any of the new games that come out, if it's not triple A, it's probably a side-scroller. Stop it. Stop it. We're in the 21st century now. Make some, make some, just stop making so many freaking side-scrollers. That's all I ask. And is Shovel Knight worth all the hype? No. 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 It's okay. It's it's an okay side scroller. But and I don't think it deserves an amiibo. Don't think I mean it deserves all these great physical copies and things like that. I get it, it's an indie game, whatever. It's not that good. It's not worth all of it. Anyways, I'm sure I'm gonna get like Oh, but it's, it's, it's an indie game, Shovel Knight, it reminds me of Mario, this, that, and the other, NES, blah, blah, blah. I don't care. I really don't. But now if I don't make it, Sin's excited about it. What the frick, man? I trust in you. Alright, that's it. I'm done.